And take my word for it. Let's actually look at what one of our customers has done with Flash Catalyst. Hi, we're Marketos Moore, a brand design firm in San Francisco. We work on a variety of different projects, ranging from print to packaging to web. We're designers, not coders. We focused on three main components for this website. A simple navigation system, a really cool interactive map, and a sexy image gallery. And the great thing is we're able to get our designs from Illustrator into Flash Catalyst with very little difficulty. Flash Catalyst is really going to allow us the ability to pass along some cost-effective solutions to our clients without having to hire developers. And it was a fun project. It was great. Sadly, I'm out of time. However, I'd love to show you the great new painting features inside of Photoshop and Illustrator, as well as the new productivity features inside of InDesign. You can head over to adobe.com and check out all of the great new CS5 features for designers. Thanks for watching. As a video editor, or motion graphics designer, or visual effects artist, you need to deliver your content to a growing number of screens from broadcast television to the silver screen to mobile and web devices. And you do this in the context of tighter production schedules and, as always, shrinking budgets. With CS5, you get blazing fast speed and efficiency thanks to an all-new Mercury playback engine. You get 64-bit native processing. You get incredibly streamlined workflows, including the industry's best native tapeless support. You get innovative new rotoscoping and tracking tools, and you get open collaborative production and flexible video distribution. So let's take a look at some of the highlights from the CS5 Production Premium Suite. My friends, my name is Jason Levine and I am a worldwide product evangelist for Adobe, healing people daily with the power of digital video and audio. And there are so many cool things to talk about, but I'm going to tell you about the five things you need to know about Production Premium CS5. So the first thing I want to talk to you about is the Adobe Mercury Playback and Render Engine. Mercury because it's lightning fast, Mercury because it's fluid, and it will completely change the way you work inside of Premiere Pro offering you breakthrough performance in your HD production workflow. Now, one of the things, of course, because it was written from the ground up, this, of course, means that Premiere Pro itself is now a native 64-bit application. But what does this mean, 64-bit? We hear this all the time now. It means RAM allocation, RAM usage. All the RAM that you have in your system can now be leveraged to do more, to play back more in your timelines, to render faster than ever before, to share between applications and move files between applications faster and more efficiently than ever before. And if you've got an NVIDIA GPU accelerated card, we can now leverage GPU accelerated effects inside of Premiere Pro CS5. Things like Gaussian Blur, things like 32-bit fast color corrector, things like the Ultra Keyer can all run. Throw them on your clips. Playback doesn't stop. So whether you're working with Red R3D, ABC Intra 100 Megabit, Sony XD Cam HD 50, or DPX files, or even DSLR formats from your Nikon or Canon cameras, these can all run together natively in the same timeline. This performance will knock you out. So the second feature I want to tell you about is so big, I'm not even quite sure how to introduce this. I mean, this is truly game changing. This will truly change the way you work in After Effects forever. And the feature itself is the fact that After Effects is also now a 64-bit native application. Do you remember when you used to work with a 30-second 1080p clip and you could only RAM preview three or maybe up to seven seconds? Well now, leveraging all that RAM in your system, you can preview that full 30 seconds. You can preview 45 seconds. You can preview 100 seconds. It just matters how much RAM you have in the system. This will change the way you work forever. And don't forget, with all of this RAM, being able to leverage all of this RAM, things like dynamic link speed up as well, right? The ability to take Premiere Pro sequences and drop them inside an After Effects timeline, truly changing the game forever. The third feature I'm going to tell you about today is my absolute favorite feature in Production Premium CS5, and it deals with the process of rotoscoping and After Effects. I could talk a lot about this, but we know that rotoscoping is a really painful, slow process. Frame by frame, lots of drawing masks. Well, you don't have to do that anymore. Allow me to show you and amaze you with the revolutionary Rotobrush. 